In this video, I'll show you how I used a stencil to transform my plain builder's grade closet. This is my closet before. Lots of holes in the walls, and as closets go in new construction, mine is pretty small. I chose a stencil I found on the Royal Design Studio website, and I decided why not add square footage by making it a glam dressing room? So we decided to patch the walls. And I started to mix some paint that I already had around the house. In order to get the effect, I had to start with a light wall followed by the dark paint over the top. I wasn't quite liking the results, so I kept going back to my paint lab and adding some more shimmer. And this was the final result, not what I wanted. I was hoping for a little more texture and warmth on that light base coat. So instead of running to the paint store, I ran to the craft store and I picked up some Deco Art Champagne craft paint, of all things, applied it in a crosshatch pattern on the wall, and this finally gave me the result I was hoping for. Something that I would be covering up anyway with dark paint in a few minutes. Now this is the fun part. My stencil came with a ceiling stencil, as you see up top. I aligned it center, and I kept repeating the bigger pattern right and left until it was finished, using level to make sure I wasn't going up or downhill and I would take the pattern all the way into the corner, and I'll show you how to do that in just a few minutes. If you look closely, you can see how to align the pattern. To finish along the ceiling, I left a half inch gap at the top, came in with painter's tape, and cut in with paint later, just like you normally would as you paint any wall or ceiling in your house. To finish off the corners, my plan was to do something similar as I did with the ceiling. I was going to leave a gap to fill in later, but first you push the stencil into the corner after aligning it, as you see in this picture. Later I came in with painter's tape, gave it a nice edge, and filled in all the gaps. I love to repurpose items I already own, so I decided to snazzy this bench up a little bit and give it a new metallic patina. I used the same paint that I used on the wall, which is the DecoArt Champagne Metallic Paint, and gave it a little facelift. Later, I reupholstered the bench as well to match the room. Meanwhile, out in our garage, we were building a custom vanity from scratch. Inspired by the Our House piece that I already have in my office, this is how we decided to go about finishing it off using trim pieces on the outer edges. We used auto body spray paint, which is highly durable and finished with a poly coat. And I love my new vanity, which is custom made just for this space. Reusing items again around the house using deco art paints. Okay, here it is, the closet before the transformation. And here it is now. All upcycled, repurposed, a custom vanity from a pile of wood and the stencil from Royal Design Studio, deco art paint, and other items from Hobby Lobby.